Hey YouTube, this is the uh, Baseball Kid here, uh, bringing you uh, my first video of the channel, which is going to be uh, kind of a glove review and uh, kind of a collection of just a few gloves that I have. Um, my brother's also in here as well, my brother Colby. Um, I'll show you some of his gloves too that he has. They're pretty good. Um, so first, um, I'm going to talk about my uh, catcher's mitt, a uh, Wilson E2000, very durable, uh, fantastic glove, uh, pro stock leather, so they're uh, pro stock uh, cowhide I think it is, yeah cowhide, um, it's 32 and a half inches, um, model number is A2403BB17911 ST. Uh, Got the uh, pro toe on it, uh, as you can see. A2000 Wilson. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, Wilson. Get out of the freaking video, Colby. Um, fantastic glove. If uh, I'm also a catcher, as well as a third and second baseman. Um, if you're a good catcher, you play in a couple showcase teams, travel teams, um, and you're looking for a good, reliable catcher's mitt. And you're willing to spend the money to get one, I recommend uh, getting a Wilson because it lasts forever. Um, just got it this year, fantastic glove, loved it a lot. Uh, Breaking period, mm, it takes it takes a while. Um, I got it steamed and uh, pounded with I, I got it steamed a couple times. Uh, pounded it with a mallet um, for hours on end. Uh, played a ton of catch with it, caught a lot of bullpens with it. Hmm? Next glove. Shut up. Uh, but yeah, great glove. So uh, the next one we're going to do is my uh, Nakona Bloodline. This is my uh, my uh, third baseman's glove that I use. Um, fantastic glove, as you can see, Nakona on the uh, stitching and on the uh, wrist right there. Um, this is the uh, Nakona Bloodline Pro Elite Series, uh, made out of deer leather, yeah, deer or buffalo leather, um, what did I say, American glove, made to last. This glove will last you forever. Um, yeah, very durable. It's 11 and a half inches. Uh, the uh, model number is BL1150. Um, use this in probably s mm, pretty much all the games. Uh, I think I played like 80 games with it, so it, not even any wear, wear and tear on it. None of the laces need redone. Easy, easy, very easy to break in. Took me, I don't know, some people say it takes like two years before it's actually fully broke in and this I broke this in completely in game ready in about a month and a half two months um, as you can see can close it very well um, sometimes I'll use this for the outfield for like center field or whatnot um, then usually when I play with the outfield I usually two two fingers to the pinky makes it very easy easy to close fantastic glove if you are looking for an infield glove. Um, my next glove that I'm going to uh, show you guys is my uh, Rawlings Gold Glove Series. Um, great glove. Used it um, my first last year. This is my last year's glove. Um, only use it for one year, but I still do, I still do use it um, when I play second base. Uh, great glove. <laughs> like it's supposed to be, but... Uh, it's a uh, Rollins Gold Glove uh, Pro Series, I think. Yeah, Pro Series, maybe, if it'll show. Yeah, oh, Pro Design, not Pro Series. My bad. Uh, the serial number is, or the model number, not serial number, is GGNP4BW. Uh, it's 11 and a half inches. Fantastic glove. Use this. Pro. Uh, for. I don't know, probably a hundred games. Uh, lasted, very durable glove, very good glove. 
um, pretty much fully broken in. Uh, it was practically almost already broke in when I bought it, which I don't know. Uh, yeah, so very easy to close. That's my second baseman's glove. Um, practically just lays there like that. It's pretty much done. Um, I am going into high school this year, so I'll probably be using all three of these gloves. Um, but if not, I'll probably have to buy another uh, outfield glove, which will probably be a Louisville TPX flared. Um, so yeah, um, that's my glove collection. Um, I'll be bringing you a few more uh, glove collection videos and uh, glove reviews. And um, thanks for watching. Uh, like and subscribe the video.